This Xbox One controller has a bad problem with joystick drift on this particular joystick. In particular, it seems to think the joystick is always forward. You can see that here in this little program I wrote. So when I let go of the joystick, there it is at minus 40% towards the top. And it also has a limited range. It can't always get to the bottom. Now I have a variable resistor that I can add into the circuit to try and bring neutral closer to zero. So we're going to go ahead and try that right now. There it is wired into the circuit. You can ignore the extra wires. That's just for the other axis. And now if I look at the result, you can see that it's been pulled down. It's because I have this in maximum resistance. If I adjust it, the dot should move closer to zero. So there we are at 22k resistance, and we've got our dot centered, but the behavior is not really ideal. So here we are at neutral. I'm going to push it forward and watch what happens. It's kind of got this zone where it's just jumping all over the place. And in fact, if I gently push it forward, it actually seems to work backwards for a little bit. Now maybe it's just really dirty there, and that's the problem. But uh, it doesn't behave that way when there's no extra resistance added into the circuit. So I'm afraid that the simple solution of adding a resistor, like one of these fixed resistors that would actually fit in there, to the Xbox One controller is not going to solve joystick drift. We need something a bit fancier than just making the wiper pole closer to ground or VDD.